Welcome back, everybody. I'm Rocket. I'm Frank Dean. We're playing Final Fantasy IX. Yeah. Where are we going now? I have to back into the woods. All right. We got everybody. We got a party. Uh, we haven't re-equipped the stick, from what I remember. Oh, that's right. We got. We stole a bunch of items, didn't we? Yeah. So we have the broadsword right now. Ready? So we do iron sword. Keep the broadsword. Keep it. Oh, yeah. We want to get beast killer first. Yeah. Gotcha. Okay. Uh, we have a bronze and a rubber helm. So we should do that one. Bug killer. We now we, now we want bug killer. Bird killer. Yeah. Uh, this is good. I guess we're gonna keep all these, right? Yeah. Do we have uh, any other options? Bronze glove. Ooh, antibody. That's a good one. Okay. So I would equip antibody immediately. I don't know if that's gonna come up in this area. Can we only do one at a time right now? So you have a point system. Ah, and if you do like next to your health. Gotcha, gotcha. This yeah. is four. Got it. Okay. Antibody keeps you from being poisoned. Let's go ahead and do Beast Killer too. And why not do Bird Killer? Why not? Yeah. And does it have any benefit to not spinning them all? No. Okay. Yeah. Because you've got a bunch of points left over too, so you might as well just have the options. Yep. You know? Now that fleet girl, you, you like I said, you probably would never flee, but you just say like, "Well, I can." Yeah. Is that, you can do this job. Like, no, nothing there. Yeah. I don't think the casters get all a lot of abilities initially, so you might have. The frog's gone. Oh. Maybe. Maybe that it? No. I want uh, goblins. Frank, have you had frog legs before? I love frog legs. frog legs. Do you love frog legs? I love frog legs. You know, I I, I'm, I have this kind of like mixed feelings about frog legs. I like chicken. Mm -hmm. And I like fish. Yeah. Well, frog legs are kind of like a mix of the two worlds together. It's they like, are. It's kind of a fishy fr fishy chicken. You're on like a really small yeah. bone. And you're just kind of like, well, okay, okay. I don't, I, it's weird because like I, I when I eat them, I'm like, this was some little jumpy cute thing. And then at the second time, and then I like, well, you know, lambs are kind of cute, but they're fucking delicious. Oh, you got an ATE here. Yeah. So basically what you're saying. Oh, the orchestra! The symbol man. Symbol man, man. It's not the, it's, it, the part that actually gets me is the, the actual taste, not the, because mm. I, So I, basically, you sit down, you order, it's like, hey, can, all right, frog legs, why not? And you sit there, you take a bite, and you say, there's something fishy about this. <sighs> you, you just keep bringing them. Oh, I'll keep bringing them. No, I'll just keep reacting the same way I'm, I'm reacting. <laughs> <laughs> oh, symbol hands. Bow, bow. Symbol hands. Okay, so it, it, he doesn't really carry them around. It's just the state of being. Did he have the bandages this whole time? No. He just recently got them. Mm -hmm. So they actually changed the... the uh, the artwork. Good. Okay, pause. At least you can see some progression. The idea that uh, we kind of got in a plane crash. Sweet. Let's jump down here. Oh, we'll walk. Mm -hmm. It's heels. But no, I already like like frog legs. Um, they're different. I don't like them as much as chicken or fish. Yeah, okay, so there was a reason to get this killer. What? Oh, run. Real quick. Like it. Is that holding the shadow? Yeah, look up, look up, look up, look up. Oh. They ran. Like, the, the, the run. Wait a minute. Uh, wrong one. Okay, that works in seven. You can, like, negate back attacks by running? Yep. I think I knew that. I think, I think, that, that's why I said that, because it's. Oh, yeah, you can do that. Yeah, the rows are switched now, so that ever happens to you in your battle where your attack actually matters, you would have to switch rows. Gotcha. Oh, well, yeah. And a fan card. Monsters can drop cards. Sweet. Now we're going to play it again. But, oh, okay, yeah. I'm sure there's probably a story element that we have to play. <laughs> there is. <laughs> they, don't, they don't let that stuff just lie. You know, they spend a lot of time on like, making a a well-balanced game. You will play this. Yeah, that's basically what they're saying. You will play this. Now, to be fair, Tetra Master is fun if you want to... Invest time into it, but I do you know. Whenever Final Fantasy XI came out, the MMO, yeah, um, I did not know that. Yeah, I did. Oh, okay. Um, part of the launcher you would have, you would have a side option just to play Tetra Master. Oh, so it's pretty cool. 
You I, didn't play? <laughs> He's like, no. I remember playing Final Fantasy XI, and this is when I was into Smirnoff and Balls. Balls. Yeah. It's my first energy drink. Balls. Yeah. You can never say that. You can never really look at somebody in the face and say, okay, what do you like to drink? Balls. Like, you're serious about this. Like, yeah, they're, they're great. it's great. You know, I have never really liked the flavor of any energy drink. Except one. And uh, I can't drink it because, like, afterwards I just feel awful. Uh, like, the sugar and caffeine, like, they hurt my stomach, they gave me heartburn, but at the same time, like, the flavor was very smooth and not very acidic going down. Yeah. And so... What, what, what was it? It was uh, the Full Throttle. Oh! Blue Agave. I don't think I've had that. I've had Full Throttle, but I've never had that. Now, now a lot of them were just so tart and acidic going yeah. down. It reminds me of when I've had too much to drink and I'm vomiting. A lot of them taste that way. And, and some of those, like, uh, alcohol, the you know, malt liquor beverages, like Four loco and uh, yeah. all those other ones. I can't remember that. I like Four loco. But, you know, Four loco is okay. Yeah. That one's not too bad. But there's some out there that are straight-up vomit. Like, it, yeah. it's like I'm drinking somebody's vomit who had Kool-Aid an hour ago. Yeah. And I'm just, ugh, no. <laughs> that sucks. Okay, so this is an ATE that's unskippable. And you'll have a few that are unskippable and their tutorials. And, yeah. Fair enough. Not really, but okay. Yeah, no. <laughs> so he's going to send them out to give uh, Zidane the map. The overworld map, is, I presume. Okay. We've got ourselves a Moogle here hiding. I'm going to go talk to him. Hey. Hey, man. Monty, you got mail from Monty. There we go. Right. And you can read it too. It's, just, it's always it's, it's a little cute. Sometimes. I'm cool, oh, too Monty. You can hit X or fill it in. Ah, oh, thank you. Yeah. Yeah. There was a. Did you play Final Fantasy Tactics? Yeah. Boy, some of the text in that, which you could not hit X to progress through, moved so slow. Yeah, I, I remember, especially the opening scene with uh, the uh, very little. Money and and it's just like oh it's meant to indicate drama, but Jesus Christ, guys! <laughs> a lot of that game, I I think that game would be so much. I, d I never played the remakes like on the handheld system. So that remix? No, they, there's like a there's a re redo version of Final Fantasy Tactics, like the original. Oh, okay. On like handheld. Yeah. But there are also the the GBA versions, which were completely new games. Uh, but um. Yeah, but there was a remake of the Final Fantasy X, and I don't know if there's an actual, like, if they fix that where you could just advance to the text or or skip the cutscenes. I wouldn't say no, because I think I think I played it on an emulator. I think it's called War of the Lions. No, that's no, it's the original PS1. Yeah, I think so. It, so, but it, I don't. I, I only played the original PS1 version, and it, it was so slow, and you just. It, it made that game almost unbearable. Almost. Yeah. Whenever you do that, make sure you hit Mog Knight again, because sometimes you're like, oh, I got something to give you. Nope, okay. Okay. Oh, I just received a letter from Stilskin. Stilskin. The, so the, the tri something. Yeah, the traveling Moogle. It wasn't like this last time I came here. Huh. So is this giving an idea of like, where he's at? And so we can deliver it to him? No, Stilskin is the traveling Moogle. Oh, so he's always going to move around. Okay. Yeah. Check again to make sure that... Okay, so those are the ones you've already read. Gotcha. Okay. I want the milk. Oh. And you can drink from the uh, the water, the well. Right here? Yeah. And I'll just heal me up. Yeah. Grinding opportunities. Not here. <laughs> not here? Well, I mean, you, 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 you can. go out and come back, go out and come back. Yeah, I mean, you can. It's just not really worth it. I always let that, um... Something in the water. I was out to a certain extent, but grinding. Oh, no. Ooh, that's very. This is not a bigger boat situation. So, presuming that the forest has its own soul, which mm -hmm. part of the forest do you think you saw there, physically? I don't. So, okay. Huh. 
Uh, I don't know. I, I would just. I. That didn't look heart-ish to me, but I guess maybe it is the heart. I'll just go ahead and say maybe. Uh, um, that sounds like would be the the, the trope when we just saw the heart of the forest. Yeah. But I will say this: it was circular in nature. Yep. It had a hot pink juicy center. True. It, it definitely screamed. Uh, weak point to me, like, you know, video game trophy weak point. And from a mechanical point of view, that makes sense, but I'm totally having my head in the gutter right here. It, it also had kind of a sphincter kind of look to it as well. <laughs> yeah. we, we had chocolate starfish going on. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no, so we just saw the ass of the forest. Yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah. I'm glad you went there, buddy. Well, I could not go there. Oh, alright, alright. I'm that one ass that we still says, so is your face. Oh, okay. Or, yeah. That's what she said. So in this game, you do have four people in the party. Oh, okay. Cool. It's always like, more is better, I guess. No, I, I think more options during combat makes things more interesting, right? That's why I like him so much. It's, it's definitely better. Yeah. Uh, um, the whole... Yeah, now being able to switch out also is kind of neat. So, you know, you have bites to stick in that little black ones. Let's get a heroin. The black guy isn't there. It's all part of his head. It's the heroin that's doing it to him. Uh, Let's get him, heroin! Okay. You seen that, like, uh, Luigi Mario video? It's like, Mario, I gotta go save the princess! And, like, Mario's like, Luigi, you got terminal brain cancer. <laughs> it's the medication making you think of this. And he's like, But, but the princess! We gotta save him! And he's like, It was a hooker that we both. Double teamed. <laughs> but, but Toad, Toad. <laughs> it's 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 hilarious. Oh yeah. This is a boss fight. Oh oh wow. I'm not paying attention. We're gonna lose. <laughs> That's what's happening here. Oh Blink. Hey. There we go. Save the day, Blank. It's Blank Man, dude. I'm gonna Blank Man. I'm gonna heal myself real quick. Go ahead. Black Mage. I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna steal. And then sword magic fire. Sword magic fire. There yeah. we go. This is um if I recall correctly, the first appearance of a uh, I forget their card. Uh Sword Mage was in five. Because of the job system. Okay. Yep. Yeah. For Final Fantasy, I mean, they've, they've been around for a while. Thunder. Bring the thunder. This battle is thunder. Ouch. Well, I was just saying, as far as grinding at an early level, I think it really robs the player an opportunity. Substantial challenge. Yeah. I mean, it, it depends on your playstyle, of course. Yeah. Um, some people are there for the challenge, some people are there for the narrative. Yeah, that's true. And then there are people that like both. I like both. I prefer, I prefer uh, mechanics over story, but... Really? Yeah, I do. I'm almost the exact opposite. Yeah, yeah I, I actually... I, I would rather be engaged by a narrative that is interesting and speaks uh, to my heart yeah. um, rather than the mechanics. And sometimes, you know, especially with poor mechanics, yeah, they get in the way. Like, the story could be amazing, but yeah. I've got a press buttons in a certain order that make me not want to play the game. Well, that's kind of why I think mechanics are more important, because I would argue that a good or bad story cannot ruin a game. But poor or bad mechanics can. I can see that. No, that uh, and I can think of five or six, six examples yeah. of Poor mechanics ruining a game. Watch out! I should have been moving. <laughs> yeah. I didn't realize I was supposed to be moving. Yeah. I just, I just thought this was some kind of like setup for the attack. Yeah. So I could have avoided this the whole combat. Yeah. I don't think it matters because they're, they're weak, but. Alright, well, burn them. Split up my attacks. You don't have to still win. I don't. I mean, like I said, you do want to still at least once per battle, but. I'm gonna do two. Okay. Since we've got four characters. Well, it only counts for Zidane as Zidane so but, but, but if the option for blank to steal, don't we get the. 
I mean, you can, but I'm as far as a uh, certain move and layer in the game goes. Okay. I mean, you can have 500 potions if you want, and uh, save 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 your uh, ethers. I would I would just go straight attack. Okay. No. So save my MP. Yeah. Yeah. Because I won't have to use my sketch. Yeah. Okay. T typical sort of like you know Final Fantasy ideas. You on fire. If you don't have to use it, of course. Yeah. <laughs> I'm pressing down. As soon as the screen came on, I was pressing down. Yeah, they are finite, I believe. So I can just sit here and whoop on these guys, and because yeah. they're super easy. Yeah. And they're not really doing much damage. Oh, the now they're doing thunder is... now. Never mind. Ow. Oh, that wasn't much. Well, he probably has an item that's reducing thunder damage. Okay. And um, he does. He's got the silk robe, which makes him learn thunder. So I'm assuming that makes him take less damage from him. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's not yeah, bad. Just keep targeting VV. I meant keep targeting heroin. Thank you. Oh. Ah, it's not even that much still. Surprise. Well, when you're doing the the, 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 the mini ones, What? You're blinded. Oh. You're blinded in your last battle. That's right. That's right. Yeah. And, and, and heroin's blinded too, so... I, uh, well, I would, but they seem to be able to go first, so... Come on. It's... Oh, that's weird. Mm -hmm. So on the menu, it's up and down, right? Yeah. But to select, you actually press left or right. <laughs> really? <laughs> yeah. Oh, I, I, I don't think it actually goes by menu, but how it physically looks on the screen. Of course, yeah, but at the same time, like, the list has the little icon next to who you're selecting. Yeah. It's, 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 it's a little weird. Oh, no, no, back up. Ah, uh, the memory cursor. So once you get out of the <clears throat> battle, you can probably throw some eye drops down. Is that if you have some? Mm. No? I don't think we do. I haven't picked any up. Well, you haven't picked any up, but you started with, I think you actually just started the game with some. Okay, so because stick, heroin, and butts all have blind. I think Blank might be immune to it since he already has a blindfold over his face. <laughs> yeah. That would make sense for him. Oh, blind? I mean, that's gonna risk you. Yeah. Alright. Hey, we got an eye drop. <laughs> Who's the most important person <laughs> to not have? I'm holding down. Holding down. Yeah, keep holding down. No, no. Let's jump, let's jump. He'll get it, he'll get it. There you go, there you go. No, no, no. Don't stop. There they are, run! Run! No, okay, you can't do it. I should have been. Now, the other one actually won't chase you, just stay there. You just kind of stand back there? Yeah, it's like, you can't come back. So, why would I want to come back? Are there are items back there I missed? No. Alright. So, uh. You can use items. Attack that items. Alright, we we'll got plenty. Okay. And. You didn't need to use it on the power one. You definitely did. Well, then, I'm gonna have to use it on eventually anyway. Or well, unless I save some places. Does saving get rid of all. Tends to. Okay. I'll be tends to. Actually, I'm not sure anymore. It's been, it's been long enough to already don't really remember that. You're spamming eye drops on people who don't. Uh... Oh, am I? Yes. Ah, uh, memory, memory cursor. Yeah. There we go. Well, yeah, okay, that was legit. Last one. Hey everybody, we're playing a game! With memory cursor. With memory cursor. I, I, I can't say we're doing a particularly good job. Maybe, maybe we should turn turn that off if I can't remember the, the memory <laughs> cursor. Wait. Well, at least the VV can see really well he, now. He's, 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 got, he's got Visine eyes. That's mm. what that's going on there. And Visine. <laughs> I'm trying to remember. Sitting here looking at the screen. I mean, if you use eye drops without a cloudy ass, that should at least give you protection for a turn, right? You know, you know. Yeah, maybe. Uh, I, as far as items go, right? Yeah. And status effects go. Like a lot of these status effects are kind of like whatever. I don't care. Uh, I don't know. Eye drops become useless later on because you get items that basically prevent you from having it in the first place. Blind sight. Yeah, no. Or, uh, I forget the name of the ability, but you have an ability that makes you need a mind. Yep, and then you get ribbons, which just prevent all status effects, you yeah. know. And, uh... There's one status that you cannot avoid, and that is, uh, virus. Okay. You know, well, 
the point I was trying to bring up was yeah. that it it feels like a wasted opportunity in a story element. They could highlight wow, it's life. <laughs> Flowery. Yeah. Spider things. Uh oh. Oh, so you killed the uh remember you killed the, the boss there? Oh the heart. Oh, so everything's dying. Oh, petrifying, I guess. Petrifying. Oh no! Plank, no! I have about 10 minutes worth of game time invested in you. Don't go. He's so cool. He's cool looking. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I Devil make your attitude. It's fine. Uh, I mean, I think you're for dying. Um, <clears throat> dude, what? Come on. What? Tentacles. Are you oh, serious? Oh, yeah, we went there, yeah? Come on. <laughs> okay, if, if this is your last throws of death, wouldn't you want revenge on a person who... I'm also going to say, like, the cinematic here. I don't mm -hmm. know if you noticed it, but there was kind of a drop and... Drop in quality? I, I, I feel like there was a little bit of drop in quality there. Like, maybe the B-team was working on it. <laughs> I don't know. B-team needs work. Yeah, they do, but... I don't know. Maybe, maybe, I'm, maybe I'm, I'm, I'm spoiled with, with so many good cinematics. I think, I think because it was darker hue. There wasn't a lot of... And it was very busy. It was a very busy cinematic. I mean, the busy stuff was fine, but like when they did the <laughs> zoom into their faces and stuff, and they're all standing there going... <gasps> it just seemed kind of meh. Yeah. So... Well, uh, we're going to end it here. We're, we're to the overwhelm, so... Yep, yep. Uh, I'm Rocket. I'm Franco Dean. And until next time... Have a modern day.